What's good, GoofTubers? It's your boy D, aka Mofaga, aka, aka, uh, uh, D23, uh, <laughs> I'll make sure that you guys are used to it. If you're not, like I said, I will make sure you are. Um, <laughs> welcome back, guys. Welcome back for some Mo Shadowgun Doze. I hope everybody's doing good. So let's go ahead and just jump right into this video. Um, before that, I apologize. My apologies for not uploading videos on like usual or regular basis, or like when I'm supposed to. And it's because I've been busy. I've been busy lately at work, and uh, work life is like really kicking my ass. So not really getting a whole lot of you know time. To basically you know upload videos for you guys to be pleasure but i will make sure that i'm uploading enough videos for you guys uh for for you guys to be pleasure to basically you know keep you guys updated and tell you guys what's going on in the world of shadowgun but like last week last couple of weeks it's just been a little stressful and um it was not really a fun time for me to make videos you know um so yeah i didn't really had an opportunity but like i said I'm sorry. We'll make sure that it won't happen again. I will try my best to you know, bring you guys videos on a daily or regular basis or my usual uh, uh, time frame when, I use, when I'm supposed to bring videos for you guys. Uh, <laughs> one, one last apology because this video that, that you guys are watching was supposed to come out on Saturday. I made a post. I made a post on my Facebook that, hey, uh, don't you worry. I'm still here. I will go ahead and, you know, uh, bring you guys a dope ass video on fucking Saturday. But on Saturday, I had a little get together and just did not have the opportunity so again didn't have the time to basically you know bring you guys video but again do not worry do not fucking worry i'm not going anywhere it's just that just a little busy didn't have the opportunity but we'll make sure it won't happen again my promise to you guys oh well enough of the freaking formality let's go ahead and you know, jump right into the fucking video already gonna talk a little bit about the shadowgun death zone and gonna talk about shadowgun legends the gameplay that you guys are watching took place in core one of the map in shadowgun dead zone um one of the old gameplay uh, end up hitting 30 plus kills wasn't really you know um, too crazy or anything like that it was just another 30 plus kills gameplay and that was that so that's first gameplay second gameplay is going to be the same video that I uploaded um, it was like on Saturday or Friday it was the gameplay that MFG employees basically shared with us uh, not shared with us it was actually it was actually a mission that MFG employee you know um, shared with us or play live on the mass stream and I also, you know, uploaded that gameplay or that mission on my channel uh, the other day. So just basically going to go over that real quick. Going to talk a little bit about that mission and, uh, you know, we'll call it a day. So let's going to start talking about the uh, things already um, or news, I quote. Uh, let's start with Shadowgun Dead Zone first. Shadowgun Dead Zone patches out for everybody who was crashing in Gemini port. Um, you guys can now update your apps if you haven't already. I know I'm a little behind on schedule in regards to that as well. But if you haven't already, just fucking go to your app store and you'll be able to update it and you will be able to play in Gemini Port. Took us a, took them about uh, took them about like a couple of months, <laughs> but they finally got it down. So that has been taken care of. But now another problem arises, which is hackers and lately we are seeing a lot of hackers in fucking game and you know it's kind of getting a little annoying um you know mike if you're watching you know you you know what to do um if i'm not wrong and i actually mentioned this in my uh, previous in, in one of my previous video that mike when i spoke with mike on facebook he told me that he's working on a couple of different things one of them was patch and you know uh work uh, one more thing is that uh, the shadow and dead zone is actually out on facebook game room so if you're a pc player want to play on pc uh you have to download it on facebook game room so yeah that's the second news uh like i was saying shadow and dead zone <clears throat> when i spoke to mike um he told me that he's working on a bunch of different things uh you know the the uh, patch and you know bringing the game on facebook uh, again and uh um the third thing that he was working on was you know uh, eliminating hackers for good so i remember him talking about that and i uh, wanted to share this with you guys one more time that he is actually aware of that and he is actually working on something like that that can eliminate the hackers for good so don't you worry you know it's possibly going to take him some time to you know come up with uh come up with the plan or you know basically accomplish what he wanted to accomplish in regards in terms of uh you know removing or eliminating the hackers for good but he is working on it 
you know once he figure it out once he you know accomplish what he want to he will definitely you know release that and uh, that will dip that will basically you know eliminate the hackers again for good this time so that was his plan you know uh, that was his plan that he was you know talking about last time um so you know just hold tight these these hackers and these hacking problems will go away pretty pretty soon uh so that was that about shadowgun dead zone let's move on to shadowgun legends real quick as you guys are watching on your screens uh this was the mission that they played on the stream called damsel in distress uh one of the mission where you're supposed to save damsel apparently damsel is one of a one of the very famous celebrity in the world of shadowgun legends and uh you just gotta go on a mission and need to rescue her so that's basically it so it seems like it's a side mission not really a main story mission um so where you're basically going and you know saving uh, rescuing the people and stuff like that so still very interesting you know i really like it even though jacob suck at gaming sometimes um i take that back most of the times <laughs> it was still fun to watch like i said i also uploaded this video on my channel if you just want to watch the watch the gameplay of that mission you can certainly click the link in description or if you want to watch the full video where jacob also died you can also you know click the link in description you also can see that as well even though this game is still like in beta stages i like the color scheme the movement of the uh, aliens have increased a little bit it's not really unkilled or dead trigger-esque you know they have improved it a little bit color scheme is good you know i like it wanted to you know comment on those a little bit because last time uh, i did really give mfg a little hard time in regards to the color scheme and how similar it looks to their other freaking game when it comes to the movement and everything else um looking good so far looking good so far gameplay itself felt or looked a little glitchy or a little laggy it could possibly be because of uh, how it was recorded or how it got captured or it could be, you know, because, you know, game is still in beta. So it could be, you know, it could be because of that. You know, if you look at it carefully, it is a little glitchy. It is a little, little laggy. You know, it's not really playing on 60 FPS where it's supposed to, you know. So uh, that's that. That's what I wanted to comment on. You know, not this is not to be taken as a negatively, you know. I'm just commenting on it because I noticed these things. And I understand that why it could have happened is because, you know, game is still in beta stages. So no big deal in regards to that. Um, but besides that, like I said, game is looking stunning. You know, color scheme coming along very good. Movement is coming along very good. Game is looking intuitive. It's looking, you know, user friendly and, you know, looking polished, looking a lot polished. So definitely I'm looking forward to it. Um, that was that about the gameplay. Um, in regards to Shadowgun Legends, one thing I wanted to comment about it is that this is actually a very, 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 very important week for Shadowgun Legends. I wish I could share it with you guys. Um, I tried to reach out to Jay, you know, to see if I can, you know, talk about it. But he didn't really respond it because apparently he was off work. Uh, so he did not check my Skype message. I could have reached him out to the fucking Facebook. But I didn't want to bother him because it was Saturday. So I don't want to bug him. Um, but it's actually a very, 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 very fucking important week for Shadowgun Legends. Uh, this week, <clears throat> without giving or telling you guys or sharing with you guys what's going on. This week is basically going to start everything. This week, if everything worked out perfectly, when it comes to your soft launch and when it comes to your um, your beta, so this is actually a very important week for Shadowgun, for Madfinger Games. I take that back. And if everything worked out perfectly, uh, we'll see soft launch most probably by next week. Most probably. Again, fingers are crossed. If everything worked out perfectly. Everything came out right. It will we'll see soft launch most probably by next week. Um, that's that. Just wanted to talk a little bit about that. Um, just want to talk a little bit about that. You know, tell you guys what's going on in the world of Shadowgun. So we are very close to the soft launch. You know, um, once soft launch is, you know, you know, already officially up. I'm pretty sure they will make an announcement for people um, who are in Netherlands who can go ahead and you know, download the game um in netherlands and you know and you know basically play and help mfg to find any other bugs and stuff like that so you know keep eye on their social media you know because the uh, next couple of weeks are going to be very 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 fucking exciting um for mfg and for the community um itself so definitely i'm looking forward to it so uh these are the few things i wanted to talk about in regards to shadow and death zone and shadow and legends like i said shadow and Dead zone patches out facebook uh, Facebook version is available on Facebook game room and regards to hacking 
Mike is already aware of it. He is actually already working on something, but once he figure out or once he accomplish what what he want to, he will basically release it and basically you know eliminate all the hacking problems. In regards to Shadowgun Legends, uh, the gameplay that we that we saw uh, of the mission called Damsel in Distress is looking phenomenal. Um, game is looking a lot more polished. I'm pretty sure once the official game releases, it's gonna look a lot more look a lot better. Uh, even 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 better than what we just saw um and very 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 important week for shadowgun legends so once everything has been taken care of in this week like i said we will most probably see soft launch by next week you know so that's that you know these were the few things i want to talk about in this video and with that being said that's basically it in this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did Definitely drop a comment, subscribe, share, like, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace, motherfuckers. Yeah. One thing I forgot to talk about: the ending of that mission. I took a, I took a screenshot. When, when you, when you're done saving damsel in that mission, it tells you, "Hey, good job, da da da." And this is the note. It says, Amiko, you're a real knight in the shining armor. Here's your cut of the reward, plus a special signed copy of her hip hop album. <laughs> Pop shit, <laughs> 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 dude. I lost it when I read that. I was like, that's fucking A, dude. Do we have like what? Kurt Cobain 2.0 in Shadowgun Legends? Oh my god, that that cracked me up. I really, really laughed hard at that. It was it was awesome. Pop shizzle and crack. <laughs> Dude. I can't fucking wait for this game. Definitely has some humor in it. Definitely. Definitely I'm looking forward to it. Alright guys, that's that. I'll see you guys next time. Peace, motherfuckers. Yeah.